Hello there, everyone. My name is Oversoul. This is Oversoul Gaming, and welcome back to Amnesia Rebirth. All right. So we activate or we solve this puzzle. I did a smart, and now we have some new toys to play with and I want to see what they do I want to see what these contraptions do I want to see mm, buttons and such buttons and such let's pull levers and push buttons oh. okay still nothing oh there's something Well, hello there, you fine specimen. Some sort of defense. Presentation. that do? Oh. Oh, it put some data here. I see. It's like an x-ray at the doctor's office. Intriguing. Oh, maybe we could do, maybe we could see what kind of little hell spawn is inside us here. That sounds like a grand idea. Um. Ah, okay. Sayonara, my friend! Thank you for your services. You just helped me figure out how to solve this puzzle. Alright. Next, please. Ah, that one's empty. Yep, that's my cue. I know what that means. Oh, okay. Well, at least we're nice and secure. They thought of everything. This is my favorite carnival ride. Come on, skinny boy. Do your job. Ooh. Right in the eyes. Alright, let's see what we got. There you are. Well, it's real. That much is for sure. I'm sorry, you didn't want me. Happy tunes, I promise. <laughs> You might be a dream, or that there was that something had gone wrong. <laughs> I something still has gone wrong. Trust me. All right, you satisfied? Uh oh. What? 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 I don't like this. <laughs> what does I, it mean? I knew there was more to this shit. Sickness. <gasps> oh, where Sickness. have you been? Sickness. Wasting. The child will be born with a sickness. It will waste her to nothing. No. I can help her. I can save her. She's ill. She's ill, I remember. Oh, God. 
Just like Alice, what do I do? Help me! Aid within these walls. Follow me. Sure, but I still don't trust you, lady. I don't trust you at all. She said to follow her. Deeple-bop a deeple -bop. Oh, right. Of course it wouldn't be that easy. I'm a fool to think otherwise. Alright. One free ride to the other place, please. Shit, I'm gonna have to... I'm gonna have to pull the lever and then get on there. Alright. At least they give you enough time. If there's something in here that's gonna help you, I've got to try it. Anything. I don't like that I'm going in backwards, though. Oh, okay, thank you. That was conveniently timed. Alright, I'm gonna have to pick a stop here at some point, right? Because I don't think there's any way in bloody hell. Ugh. Okay. Yeah, I kind of figured that would be bad for me to... Oh, shit, that would have sucked. <laughs> that would have fucking sucked. Just drop you off into this... Ouch. That probably would have hurt, too. That would have been rude as hell. I'm glad I got off when I did. Damn. Thank you. Alright. I'll slide on my own terms, thank you. Oh, damn it. Yeah, it would have been fun when the time came. But you knew it was coming this time, so shut up. What? It's just a pit of bones? You've seen worse. Calm down, Tassie. Okay. Is this my route? Of course it is. Da, 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 the joy event sneaks. Uh, come on. Oh, my lantern is going to go bye bye. I'm just gonna put it away and use my blue light filter. Geronimo! Hello. Any visuals? Okay. Ooh. Smack myself in the face with that. Alright, I need my light. Apparently. It would seem. Oh, I can stand in here. Knock, knock. It is I, Tassi Trianon, here to invade the Dark World once more. Any spooks about? Oh. Well, this place doesn't seem very friendly. How about I not go there yet? Let's see what's down this hallway instead. Hallways are fun. Ooh, green light. The flames of the dark world burn differently. Nothing down here. Nothing but a dead end and a chance for me to light more torches. Not like I needed to. Okay, so what's up these stairs, then? Yes, I'm trying to prolong going out into that area as long as possible, because I don't like the looks of it, no sir, mm -mm. Oh. Well, that's the only torch I see here. This... Not sure where that leads. 
Ooh. Ah, lantern oil. Guess I'm gonna be needing that. Alright, what the fuck is this nonsense? I gotta get through down here. This does not look pleasant at all. But I guess we'll find out! Wait, Kabaga. Alright. Let's go find out. You don't want to know what I'm stepping on. I grab. Oh, that's an arm. How lovely. Oh, yes, yeah, so I'll just casually pick up this arm. Thank you. Okay. Hopefully, these things don't still move, because. Uh oh. What the f. That's a good question. Hey, uh, Empress Lady? You want so badly to keep me safe, right? How can you keep leading me into danger? Ugh. Gross. Yep, I'm running. Not sure if I needed to, but I'm going. <laughs> oh, my heart. <laughs> so she did die. Damn, that sucks. I mean, I had a feeling, but... Well, that's still not confirmation, but... I'm still, that's, that's my theory, and I'm sticking with it. Diagnostician. Ah, yes, because I diagnosed myself. I gave myself a diagnosis. Alright, so now where the hell am I? And why the hell am I? And when the hell am I? And who, how, what, for, when, then, how? I need torches that I can light so that Tassie doesn't feel fright. There we go. That door doesn't... door. Ooh. No power. This place is some sort of station, I think. Like what, like a train station? These do kind of look like carriages? Car kinda? Yeah, like I could get inside one of those? Or are they cages? Ugh, I don't want to think about them being cages. <laughs> hmm. Ah. Okay, so, ooh, that is an interesting looking moon! My goodness. So, uh, we're gonna have to go this way then. I don't see any other route around here. Ooh. Look, those bright places. I think they're more rifts back to our world. Can we get to one of them? Hopefully. She promised aid. Within these walls, she said. Promises, promises. Oh, I don't like that sound. I mean, I don't think I'm supposed to like that sound, but either way, you know. Okay. Man, they really had me thinking something was at the top of these stairs. 
I was definitely a wee bit worried for a minute there. I need... I still don't know if I should be worried or not. Ooh, that doesn't sound good. But for now, I'm going to, uh... Are these... Are these both memory spheres? I think they are. Did I just hear a door? Alright, I think we're okay to watch these, though. Or whatever, listen to them. It is time. I hold her down, stroking her neck. She's oblivious, nuzzling at me. I thank her for her company, for her comfort, for her nourishment. I cut her throat swiftly. Damn. She complains, but it does not take long. I catch the blood in a clay pot. She will save us this winter. That's... That... It's a memory, I think. Yeah, just like all the other ones. Now let's watch this one. Pavlos, by my knee, delivers constant chatter about the honeycomb he found. Fila, little face, serious, tongue stuck out as she draws in the earth with his stick. Hermia catches the boy up in her arms and flashes me a tired smile. I too am tired. But I am grateful for this day. And I too am tired, but I am grateful for this game. But let's move forward and get ourselves killed. Oh, come on. Okay, so... Can I force it open? Yep. Use that ghoul strength. Grrr, tossy strong. There we go. Alright, any torches in here I can light up so I don't have to waste lantern oil while I'm looking at stuff. What the fuck? Why is there smoke rising up there? I don't like that. <laughs> Oh! Here. Oh! This is it's the place I can help Amari. We die is life against sickness. What do I have to do? Create. We die. Sit. Be healed. Okay. The energy that powered the portal. Right, because that was so easy to find last time. Yeah, we Go killed the man. Mary. There must be a way to make it here, or she wouldn't have said it. I see, so this is the throne that we'll sit in, huh? When the time comes. Oh, I see now. Yeah, but this place has literally no power. We gotta get a power source from somewhere. Another of these energy devices. Yep. And no way to power it up. That's a diagram of a hand. It does me no good. What about this? That is a diagram of a body. Not a human one, though. Alright. Only one way we can go. Use that ghoul strength. Ah, yeah, ghoulin' it on up. Alright. This place is pretty well lit. I don't really need torches and shit like that here. And there's another one of those things, too. Hold on, first we'll read this. Under the sign of... Olan, on the eighth rise at the third calling, I, Kimai, make this record. There is a fault on the third shuttle rail. I have diverted stock to Factory 5 while this is investigated. As a result, Portal Station 
Ricosta reports unsanitary stock buildup and requests additional staff with and curry stones to control the harvesters. I have forwarded the message to allocation, so recorded in her name eternal. So I get the feeling that the harvesters are the ghouls. The ghouls are the harvesters. Is that right? I lie amongst rustling grass up on the hillside above the bay. It is the day after the rain. I can smell the green on the breeze. The skies are blue now, with only wisps of cloud. The bell of the white goat clanks nearby as she rips and chews at leaves. I close my eyes and listen to the world. And tell me, what did the world say? find a way, we swear it. Ooh. I'm detecting a rift nearby. What the hell is this? Oh, I don't have any matches. Oh, but there is a sphere here. The wind howls. Or a cylinder. But I am warm. Why do I keep Cocooned calling them under the blanket by the fire. Her head rests on my shoulder. And I listen as her words flow. Plans, hopes, dreams, fantasies. Everything that we know is impossible. But I know that it doesn't matter. For we will be together. And that is everything. Was that written by someone who was love-struck by the Empress? Hmm. This is a creepy looking room. So much mad scientist shit going on up in here. What is this? Oh, excuse me. Hello, allow me to get a good look at you. I don't know what any of this means. Hiya! I don't know what it means, but it does make for a good screenshot, doesn't it? I'll take that. Come on, there you go, thank you. Okay, so... This looks familiar, wasn't I in here already? No, 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 no. I don't think I was. This is different. Oh. What the fuck? Oh, that thing moved. I don't like that it did that. Right, I'm gonna go somewhere else. Jesus Christ, this place is creepy. Hi there, let's go. Anything useful? Aha, matches. Thank you. I really don't like that noise. Every time I hear it, it makes me nervous. But it could just be those rocks. You know the ones I'm talking about with the, um... Oh, there's another one of these. Under the sign of Edu on the fourth rise at the second calling, I and Aru make this record. Research into the revised chamber has led to a breakthrough. Introducing the memory capsules allows for a more intense reaction to the pain, rising to a tensor level of 17 immediately. Subjects no longer rapidly burn out. Our supply problem is solved. Stimulation of the nerves, followed by a dose of elixir of emerish, followed by an application of the subject's own best memories. Or to view it another way, 
Fear Oblivion. So they extract in her name eternal. So they extract fear from people to get the V tie. Huh, sounds familiar. Oh, we have lots of things to read here. Holy shit. Subject 1143 SV. Initial extraction indicates subservient class. No immediate family, low potential yield. Focus further extraction on earliest memories, but also consider discard. Subject 1145SV, initial extraction, indicates worker class with a familial structure consisting of a partner and two offspring at the time of capture. High potential yield per protocol, focus further extraction on early contact with partner and formative years of offspring. In addition, typical strong memories relate to capture location and parental connection. And finally... Subject 1144 SV initial extraction indicates worker class, no immediate family, but a strong connection to a single individual. Average potential yield. Focus further extraction on contacts with that individual. Ignore all pre adult memories, as no familial connections typically indicate no positive material to use. Yeah, so, ways to extract fear from people in order to get that sweet, sweet VT. Oh, another one. It is the first time I have seen him in a week. I honestly and thought that was late turn away. Ten years have bent his spine, sapping the flesh and the color from his cheeks. His eyes are red rimmed. They will not meet mine. Fear grips my heart and starts to squeeze. Son, he says, she is with the gods now. Well, all right then. Sounds like somebody died. Um... Oh, I can't pick it up without... There we go. But I don't need to use it right now because it's so well lit in here. Excuse me. Oh! Here's the thing I need! I found it. What's this? I need to tell you about Alice, little one. She was your sister. For a while, in our little rooms in Paris, it was just the three of us. She loved stories. And she loved to play in the park. And she... She's with your father now. And you're with me. Oh, and, uh, <laughs> There was Maca. Alice is toy monkey. I've got him. I've got him here. I'm sure she'd love him to be yours. Ah, yes. Figured there'd be something on here, right? Ooh. Just stay calm, my love. Stay with me. All will be well. Yes, everything should be fine. Don't you worry. We'll figure it out. We'll figure late this shit out. Okay. Get back. 
Oh no! Ah! Right, get no! Oh shit! What the fuck? No! Stop! Ah! I'm stuck. I don't know what I'm doing. Ah! Yeah! 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 Ah! Play prone. Go prone. I don't know if that works on this game too or not. But we're gonna try. Yes. All right. So that thing has like a searchlight that it's carrying around or something. And if you get caught in that searchlight, you get like stunned. Okay. Calm down, child. Uh-oh. Things are so bad, even the, the floor is glitching. I need that fucking light thing, though, for real. How am I supposed to do? How am I supposed to get that? Oh, it's all the way over there. No! Come on! You can't hold items when it's got you in its light. Ugh. Oh shit. Uh oh. That's not good. Oh. Like what, three times that I've died now? <laughs> I'm not good at this. No, I'm not going to turn into Leon. You are if we don't stop this. See, you can't actually die because the Empress has got our back, is the way it seems. You know, because Tassie didn't die. She just ran away and hidden here. Like a smart person, which is what I should have done. But, yeah. But the problem is constantly giving in to fear like that or constantly being faced with scary situations like that is going to make us turn go full ghoul, you know, because that's part of it, the giving in to fear. That's how the illness spreads. So we need to be more careful. I definitely... But what was I supposed to do there? That thing... Anytime I grabbed that... Thi the, the, the thing I needed, the fucking monster knew exactly where I was. And if you get caught in its light and you get stunned, you drop whatever you're carrying. So I couldn't... Like, it was in a bad spot. I didn't know what to do. It's kind of kind of screwed there, honestly. Kind of screwed myself where I dropped that. So, yikes. But anyways, that'll be it for this episode. Let me know what you uh, what you thought of this episode and the game so far, and our new uh, our new searchlight monster friend in the comments down below. If you enjoyed this video, go ahead and leave it a like. And as always, thank you all so much for watching. I will catch you possibly on another day, definitely at another time, and likely in another video. Okay, goodbye.